Hey guys, this is Cyrock Omega, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Yellow Gifts Only. Last time, we got ourselves our Bulbasaur and named it Verdant, and we easily dispatched with Misty and then Jerry. So now we just gotta take a look at uh, how we get out of this place. So, uh, nothing directly east. I look like a place you can go from there, but I don't know. What are you, why are you talking to your Pokeball? Oh, that's wrong. So, yeah, I guess, how would you... Yeah, I mean, the only way that you could get an electrode at this point would be by trading with someone. Whoa, look away. Alright. Anyway, yeah, there's that, that, and what do we got? To, what's down here? Trainer tips. Pressing B button during evolution cancels the whole process. So, don't want to do that. If we could just cut through this thing. Bah! Bah! I say bah. So, well, you don't really have too much else to do other- Have I talked to this guy? What do you gotta say, bro? Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, all these bushes, and these dancing flowers, and that guy with a big hat. Anyway, let's just head up north. We'll talk to Bill and hope that we can get progressed that way. What's up here? There's a little bit of a jumpy place. That's the outgoing. This is the incoming. So let's hold on. First of all, we're gonna want to have Burden up front, so that he can at least get some experience. Let's see what he can get by fighting some of these losers. Oh, there are nuggets on this bridge. Oh, I'll, be I'll beat all you nuggets. All five trainers win a fabulous prize. Good thing we can just go back and heal after every single one of them. And I don't think any of them are in any way difficult. We'll see how many that Verdant can beat by himself. A bug catcher shouldn't be that hard. Same level as a Caterpie. It's a real shame that it's not a Butterfree. How is Grass against... Oh, he's faster than us. Ugh, that's annoying. Okay, so Grass is not good against Bug. Noted. Really sucks. So Tackle... Tackle will do well enough. It'll take a little bit. But it'll do, for now at least. We want that XP. We can at least take... Oh, crit, thank you. You can at least take out this Caterpie. String Shot doesn't make any difference. I don't know why the AI thinks that would have been decent. You know, Fine Whip. I forget what level it learns Razor Leaf. Razor Leaf is a decent bit better than Vine Whip, but slightly less accurate by like 5 points or 5 percentage or something. Uh, no, it won't change Pokemon. Let's try Leech Seed. What the hell? You really don't need to slow me down any more than I already was. Alright. Yeah, you know, just keep trying that. Okay, I, we maybe we'll be able to do this. Poison thing. Yeah, and it can't be poisoned because it is half poison type, which is awesome. So um, yeah, like the only pure grass type in first gen is like Tang Tangela, Tangela, however you want to pronounce it. I think, I say Tangela, because like Tangled, not like the Disney movie, but like the thing that happens to hair and vines. Come on, hit guy. It's getting annoying. Um, Anyway, so yeah, it's kind of weird that the only, no the only pure grass type in first gen is Tangela, and the only pure rock type... Is there even any? No, there aren't any pure rock types. Are there even any in second gen? Hmm. I'm trying to think. Leave me a comment, like, what is the pure rock type in second gen? I know that a pure rock in third gen is, like, nose pass. Level 15, cool. Good stuff. Yes. <laughs> I did my best and I have no regrets. I wonder how they organized. Uh, well, we'll meet who... Who organized. I wonder how they organized all these losers. Like, how much are they getting paid to stand here on a bridge? And anyone that comes up and talks to you... Or, like, passes in front of your vision... You fight them. Okay, so it looks like special is one point above attack, so it's not really too big of a difference. 
So you, Vine Whip ultimately probably would be a better attack against anything that it isn't strong against. But I am going to use... Ah, uh, my throat's getting scratchy. I'm drinking water, so I'll use a potion. Because I just don't feel like going all the way back there. Fight me, little girl. Oh wow, yeah, second is serious. The first one, he was just joking around. Number two is serious business. Serious business, guys. With that, like, little schoolgirl outfit. She's serious. She's ready to murder people. Okay, how about, uh, yeah, you're probably gonna be faster, so... Leech Seed? Gosh, though, hopefully this won't be too bad. Ooh, that, that was a crit. And evaded the attack, whatever. This is not looking good. Not looking good for Verdant. Oh, yeah, and weak against that, too. Or strong against it. Whatever. Let's switch you out to uh, Fulgur. We get a little bit easier. All too easy. Well, Nidoran, female. No, I won't switch out. I, I kind of just want to get to level 26 so I can get Thunderbolt. Nice and easy. I think probably one more battle will probably get me up to level 26. What? You say the same thing? That's kind of weird. I wonder if they all say they don't have any regrets. Uh, it would be funny if the last one says, I regret everything. I still want to keep, um... Keep getting Verdant some experience, but... There really isn't anything that he could fight too well right now. Whatever, I'm gonna use that... Ah, uh, no, 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 I won't, I won't. I'll just keep switching them all out. So the last one was serious, but this one won't be easy. Okay, that's good to know. Got three Pokemon. Rattata. Hmm, can I... If I Leech Seed... A Hyper Fang, okay, I think that'll do it. That'll do it. Poor Verdant. Okay, I'll, I'll send out Fulgur. Now what move should I get rid of to, for Thunderbolt? Like, if we were doing being super strategy and all that, getting rid of Thundershock wouldn't be bad, because Thunderbolt is kind of just a, um, a weaker version of Thunderbolt, but Thundershock is more PP. The thing is, I'm not going to use Double Team all that much. I mean, it's like, there's a difference between Quick Attack, Zaz Priority, and Slam, which does more damage, but the only difference between Thunderbolt and Thundershock is that Thunderbolt is stronger, but it has less PP. So, I don't know. Thunder... I'm probably gonna get rid of Thunder Shock for Thunder when it comes up. So, whatever. Thunder Shock. And... Oh. Leer. Okay. Um... What was I saying? But anyway, yeah. I'm probably going to double up on a couple... Couple, uh... Like, same type attack moves. Yeah, there we go. Thunderbolt. That's what I want. Yeah, I'll get rid of Double Team, because I really don't use that. Because normally, if you are strong enough, you just take down anything in two attacks. So there's not really too much point in getting rid of... Uh, in using Double Team. Because... And most of the people you fight don't uh, have more than three Pokemon normally. Sometimes four. Double Team would be excellent, I'm sure, in um, competitive or even just fighting the Elite Four. Who I think they, other than the champion, have five Pokemon each. Whatever, yeah, I'll just get rid of double team. You can really use any Pokemon you want in uh, just playing through the game normally. Because it's that easy. It's that easy. If it was a mod, which tend to be very difficult, yeah, I'll, I won't switch up. If you're playing a mod, then maybe you're going to want to consider uh, being a bit more strategic, because from what I hear, they're almost always more difficult. Like, they are significantly more difficult than regular Pokemon games. 
Stomped flat. Do you have any regrets, friend? No regrets. So I'm just gonna go down and heal, because I want Verdant to be getting more experience. Alright, we're back here, all healed up, and I wasted that one potion, so let's fight this little girl with a ponytail. Getting tired? No, I literally just went to go heal up. If only they actually put up a fence or something that disallowed you from going to heal. Then this might be a challenge. Okay, so we're... Mm, this is a bad spot, so I'm just gonna switch out... This time I'll just switch to Leviathan, who I keep forgetting to give him Bubble Beam. Okay, quick attack. Oh, yeah, so weak. Um, I think Bite is, uh... I was just getting all quick attack with me. Getting all quick attacky. Bite, just eat the Pidgey. Ah, oh, that reminds me of this one GIF, a really good animated GIF of a Pokemon battle where someone sends out a, um... About to use Nidoran female. I feel like we've seen that... that... Uh, this trainer before. Of... Okay, so someone sends out a Gyarados, and it uses, it like flies up in the air, it's all powerful and super cool and all that, it uses Hyper Beam, like the most powerful attack he can have, and it hits the Pidgey, and it's like, a huge explosion, and then, Pidgey fainted. Yeah. <laughs> Double kick, okay, don't do too much damage, fighting doesn't do too much against grass, or poison. One of those, I think it's poison. So that's just gonna take up more time than it should. But, uh, yeah, let's see. Vine Whip! Okay, Tackle might be a bit of a problem. So, Leech Seed isn't a bad strategy. Okay, and Grass isn't good against Poison. Noted. I keep forgetting these little things. Like, I know Fire is good against Grass, and Grass is good against Water, and Water against Fire, and all that. Obviously. But, I mean, some of the other ones kind of slip my mind. But yeah, early on, I suppose... Uh, Leech Seed isn't a bad attack to use. Because it gives me a little XP. Because if we're on about the same level, it's not too bad. Make all the difference. Like here, the Leech Seed would have uh, probably helped me win this fight, or at least get closer to winning. I think we can do it. I have fate. Oh, wait, never mind. I don't think we can. Oh, we'll see. We'll see real quick. Again, tackle. Crit, maybe? I, can I do it? Okay, growl. That might have done it. The growl might have saved it for me. Yes? Can I still take it with how much damage it would do? Yes, there we are. Nice. I think it, it evolves at level 20-something, I forget. You lost too. You did your best, but you have no regrets. Number five. I'll stamp you. Stamped like a postage. Juniorman. And he's got a Mankey! Indeed he does. Okay, so how about... We'll switch you out to... This Leviathan. For whatever reason. I probably shouldn't even be using Leviathan all that much. Because I'm not going to be using him very much. At least, uh, well, later game. I think... Like, what do you... Would you say that Saffron City is a late game, mid, or mid game? I don't know. Alright, level 16, awesome. And you level 2, cool. Too much! Oh, well, oh, there we go! Verdant is evolving already. That was quick. Vernon evolved an Ivysaur! Cool. So, you did your best, and you have no regrets. So, how we doing on stats? Okay, now physical is doing... I don't know, special is a bit better than physical now, so that's cool. Um, when does he learn Vine Whip? I forget. But whatever. Let's head on up! That was all five, so... Congratulations! You beat our five contest trainers! <laughs> You just earned a fabulous prize! I got a nugget. I guess that's why it's called the No Regrets Bridge. Wait, no, that's not right. Would you like to join Team Rocket? Like, all these losers apparently were too weak to, uh, join Team Rocket, so they just put them on a bridge and have them be a gauntlet. 
whatever. Group dedicated to evil using Pokemon. Isn't that great? Oh yeah, I'd love to join. Yeah, I'm sure. I'd love to join. What are you talking about? Okay, I'd love to join. I don't need any convincing. What are you... Uh, oh. So yeah, the one that would be kind of interesting... There has to be a mod. I keep talking about mods that I've never played. There has to be a mod where you actually join Team Rocket, like at this point or something. So he's got an Ekans, and you got Verdant. Real cool. Let's... Hmm. I'll try out using Verdant a little... Okay. It evaded. Poison Sting, not gonna do too much. I'm gonna keep trying to... Come on. Leech Seed. Leech Seed, please. Oh, no. That's, this isn't gonna happen. You know what? Screw it. If you don't get knocked out, I'm switching. Yeah, okay. There we go. I keep forgetting to get, um, Bubble Beam to Leviathan here. Oh, yeah, I never ever said what, uh... Oh, now he's poisoned. That's great. I never told you what, uh, why Magikarp sucks so much. Other than its stats being bad, it uses its only attack until it learns Tackle is Splash. No effect. So I just wanted to show that off. It's not gonna be too long until I can... It'll be easy. I'll eat this little snake with one bite. Maybe two. One bite. Okay. Real good. Yep, wait. Yep. I don't know why I was saying that. Yeah, I'll switch out to Fulger. I'll show off my fancy Thunderbolt. If I haven't done that already. Thunderbolt! Seizure warning? Haha, <laughs> too easy. Arg, you are good. With your ability, you could become a top leader in Team Rocket. I'm gonna beat the top leader in Team Rocket, I promise you. Do you have any regrets? Apparently, he does. So, ah, uh, we're poisoned. Huh, let's, I wonder what this guy has to say. But whatever, how are you feeling there? Oh, he's very happy. He's just jubilant. But I'd say that's a good enough place to leave off for now. We we defeated the Nugget Bridge of Regret. And Verdant evolved already. And just real quick, before I forget, which I inevitably will, I'm going to teach TM11 to Leviathan. Because, um, yeah, by the time I get my next... Um, well, the next... By the time I get Lapras, I, it's going to be, um... I, I'll have Surf, and Surf is better than Bubble Beam, so... And I can use Surf as many times as I'd like. So I'm gonna teach Leviathan Bubble Beam. I'm not even gonna get rid of Water Gun, because it's better to have two attacks that just do varying amounts of damage, rather than having Splash, which is absolutely worthless. Goodbye, the vestiges of Leviathan's childhood, or fishdom, whatever you want to call it. Let's get rid of Splash and learn Bubble Beam. Awesome. So I'm just actually gonna go down and uh, heal in between this and next episode. So thank you guys very much for joining me. Rock over London, rock on Chicago. I'm Cyrock Omega, and have a nice day. Later. Actually, you know what? Um, yes, if you, if you can get a comment telling me a name for Charmander slash Charmeleon slash Charizard before um, the day after this video comes up, I might be using that name. If you don't like Verdant and just how I name names, give me one. So, I'll talk to you later. Bye.